Hey everyone, here's the video you've been waiting to see. This was pretty amazing. So I'm gonna start out with my MVP products. Most bang for your buck. These most valuable players on my list are trivets. This is a trivet. Cast iron, hand painted. This falls in the category of kitschy. So I got this for 69 sets. I flipped this for $12.99 to $19.99 all day, all the time. I get these everywhere I go usually for anywhere between 99 cents and two dollars this one is a wooden framed seasonal trivet that was a dollar 29 because it's a little bit bigger this one is by him mark giftware so this one is signed by saltera so this one would probably go for a little bit more because it's christmas and because it's signed it's going to be worth a little bit more it also has the original sticker on the back along with the hanger itself a dollar 29 keep your eyes out for Delft blue Delft blue is a hand painted dish from Holland and it's hand signed on the back hand painted I got this for 297 and they'll go for 10 bucks all day plus shipping you can see it's almost like watercolor and then they have holes to hang it it's you have to pay attention to the themes windmills nautical is very big right now so I'm definitely going to be able to sell this easily for 10 10 50 a piece and I have two that is a six dollar investment and I'm making minimum twenty dollars back Next up, a great thing for Christmas is ornaments. Ornaments sell like crazy. Go on eBay, look up sold listings and do Christmas ornaments. You'll find all kinds of stuff. Right here, I got a set of three. They're ceramic. Each one's a different word. And these I got for $1.29. And I'm going to be able to sell these minimum for $14.99 plus shipping for less than $2. Next up. As you've seen or heard me say or looked on the website, I do not have loss. And part of this is by crafting. So I actually buy craft junk, broken jewelry from everywhere. And this place actually had a whole bag for $2. I got an entire sandwich bag full of jewelry for $2. Yes, it's broken. Can I sell it? No. But can I use it? Absolutely. An example of what I do with my broken jewelry so that I don't have any loss, making frames and mirrors out of broken jewelry and just creating some really cool intricate designs out of that those pieces. So this is just one example of what I do with broken jewelry. And then I'm going to sell this for anywhere between $49.99 in 89.99 the one thing that you have to know about this is jewelry and to make sure that you do not put anything valuable on your projects because if you do people are just gonna buy it to pop it off but we'll get more into that as the videos go on and we'll learn how to identify those items Next up, again, hat, John Deere, with tags, still on it, and I got this for $2. $2, I walked in, I saw this hat, hat tags, $2. Easy flip, $14.99, plus shipping. Next up is a ornament, which is made of glass. This is a pressed glass ornament with a stamp of a fish, 50 cents. These go online 
for sale for $13.50. They sell for $13.50. I got it for 50 cents. All you have to do is put a little ribbon in it and sell it. Put dream catcher, put art glass, put ornament, put fish pressed glass, and it will sell. Plus shipping on eBay, I'm, you're looking at $19.99. On my website, you're looking more between $16 and $18.99. Next up is Domino's. Believe it or not, I got this for $1.27. Marble-like Domino's. Just plain Jane. They're a little dirty, sorry, but they will be washed. <laughs> plain Domino's, $1.29. These will go for $14.99 to $25.99 plus shipping. Next up, shoes. I'm leaving this store and I see, I look down and there's rows of shoes underneath all the clothes. I didn't even see them. So, hold up. <laughs> I look down and I see Versani. I see Versani heels. Size six and a half. Beautiful heels. You have the stamp on the back and you can see where it's branded in the leather. Made in Italy. Barely worn for $2. Barely worn. These go anywhere between $30 and $50 a pair on Poshmark, eBay. Another name to remember in shoes is Antonio Milani. These shoes go anywhere between $35 and $65 online. They're over $100 shoes, but they have the thick sole, they're leather, they have the support, and then sign underneath. High brand, high end. And I got these for $3. These sell. What? Oh, what happened? It's gone, it's dead, it's dead. <laughs> Next up, for $2.49, I got NOS, New Old Stock, placemats, set of four, and napkins, set of four. Still sealed with the sticker. I know you see that green. Well, the back of it, the, the back of it, the green part is starting to come off. But you can get a little bit of sandpaper, sand it off, and then on the front, I even put my hand, my finger in there just to see if it would wipe off. And this comes right off. It's even called sponge clean. So, all you have to do is wipe this off. These are brand new old stock. And definitely put that in your title, NOS. Next up, I got vinyl records. Keep in mind, you want to buy vinyl records in bulk to find the good ones that are worth a lot of money. Now, when you don't have the opportunity to do that or to buy a big, a big lot of vinyls, you can go and find vinyls at your local thrift store. For 95 cents, I got each one of these albums, 95 cents. I can either sell them individually or I can sell them as a lot. And all of these are, you're looking between $2 and $40, give or take. Nat King Cole. Musical Festival, Disney, Fantasia, I just love the graphics in this one, an unused, unopened album, 95 cents, Jefferson Starship, I also got the Who. Brand new, unopened, still in the package for 95 cents. 